Hey, it's Jay. Welcome back to an exciting episode of Plasma Channel. In the last episode, we covered how water really isn't that conductive. So I was curious, what happens if you take an unstoppable force like high voltage and you combine it with an immovable object, something that doesn't conduct, like pure water? Well, that's when science breaks. And you get what's called the water bridge. Okay, plasmateers, essentially what you're looking at is a bridge of water defying gravity. Now, I don't know about you guys, but that was pretty cool. That's the end result of forcing electrons into water when water doesn't want to accept them. So let me go ahead and show you my setup here so that you can potentially duplicate this on your own. Luckily, the materials are quite basic. You need about 20 kilovolts DC, two glass measuring cups full of distilled water, and some wire. And that's it. Now go ahead and wrap the wires around the handles of the measuring cups. This essentially will keep the wire in place. Tuck that wire down into the distilled water, and repeat this process for both measuring cups. One cup for a positive lead, and one cup for a negative lead. Making sure the spouts of your cups are touching and your water level's right, turn on the power and slowly pull one cup away from the other until you've got a water bridge. <laughs> awesome. With a high enough voltage, this can be stretched out to about an inch. As for the physics behind this, science hasn't quite pinpointed it yet, but we do have a general idea. Though it does need to be studied further, the high voltage creates a high tangent electrical field. This creates surface polarization of the water surface. The electric field then basically stabilizes the water bridge and allows it to essentially levitate. And it's due to those electrical fields that water is repelled away from both cups and meets in the middle. Now these bridges also get extremely hot, but in the process of trying to film that, I managed to get myself a one inch long filament. And you know what? After all this, the water still tastes like... Uh, inevitable indigestion. Because <laughs> you're not supposed to drink the eye water. So hopefully you liked this video. Hope you learned something pretty cool like the water bridge. Uh, if you did, do us a massive favor. Leave a like, leave a comment, uh, share the video with people you think might enjoy it. And don't forget to subscribe to Plasma Channel. Check out our Facebook page for teasers for upcoming episodes. Click the box to your left to see our last episode on how water really is not conductive. You stay classy.